guys welcome back to my channel in today's video we are going to be discussing and talking about some new brazy beauty high products that um i don't know if they're going to launch after this video gets uploaded or the day after um i'll go ahead and actually put when i will be launching right over here so i still have a lot more products on the way but i'm so excited to get these out to you so i decided to go ahead and just launch what products i have received first and then when the rest of them come in we're just gonna launch as they come in well i already did majority of my makeup my face is looking very flat right now because we haven't done bronzer or anything like that yet so we're gonna go ahead and talk about some new products we have some goodies right here oh you can't even see this one right now a lot of people have been missing our bronzers we had two shades um coconut and bronzy mommy i definitely want to bring out more shades so that way it's more it's more inclusive for everyone but unfortunately i am still a very very small brand so i don't want to bring out a whole bunch and then it just sits around so i want to go ahead and show you guys so these are my new bronzers They come in this packaging now. They before came in a tiny little square packaging, but we have changed it up a bit and I feel like it just looks so much more sleek and luxe. And then you have a little button that you press here to pop it open. And here is the bronzer. So this one is coconut. As you can see, it's still the same light warm bronze. And with bronzers, I designed it like this. I know a lot of people have probably mistaken it as a powder foundation, but I love to touch up my bronzer throughout the day because I just love to always stay bronzy. So right underneath, you get a little sponge. And you can just touch up. And then the next one is our other popular one that we had still in the packaging. This one is Bronzy Mommy. So it's just a little bit darker and warmer than coconut. So that way you can choose if you want a lighter bronze or a darker bronze. Today we are going to go in with Bronzy Mommy because I'm feeling very bronzy today. So I'm just going to do my bronzer so you guys can see how it applies, how pigmented it is, how easy it blends. So my bronzers are very pigmented. My mirror is over here, so I'm going to be looking over here, but I'll try to get it in the frame. Do you see that? Very pigmented, but... And keep in mind, I love to tap my bronzers in. I don't like to do circular motions because it just moves your makeup that's underneath. But if you look at that, I'm just tapping it in and look at how nicely it's already just blending into my skin. Like it's, I formulated these powders to become one with your skin. So it's not sitting on top of your skin, but it's blending in. So that way it doesn't look so like harsh and yeah. You see how easy that just blended? I didn't even have to throw my blush. I just tapped it. That's another reason why I formulated these the way I did. Um, these are definitely improved from my last bronzers that I had. These are completely different formulas. They are amazing. I formulated this specifically to where you tap it in to not move the makeup underneath, but as you're tapping it, it pretty much blends itself. Here's one cheek without, one with. And then I'm just gonna do one tap and I'm gonna do my forehead. And again, you're gonna blend it into the hairline so you don't have that gap. So look at how I'm literally just, I'm not really putting in that much effort and the bronzer is pretty much just blending it itself. And whatever's left, I'm gonna just put it on my jawline. And then, oh, the side of my nose. 
mascaras, half of my face with bronzer and half without. I'm telling you, these new bronzers are super smooth. You don't even need that much. They're so easy to work with. So if you're someone who is trying to get into makeup and you know, let's like you want something that's foolproof. I got you. I got you. I'm sorry, my camera keeps like adjusting really weirdly. Like it keeps going dark and it's so weird. But anyways, I hope you guys can see. Here, I'll come closer. Look at that. And even if you're not a beginner, like you're, let's say you're, I just poked my eye. Let's say you're pretty experienced with makeup. This is still a must in your makeup kit. Okay, bronzer is done. Just look at how smooth that application is. Mm. Next we have blush. So this is how our blush looks like now. I'm in love with all of my new packagings. I just feel like they just fit my brand better. Two shades available. Um, they're completely new shades from what I previously had. Um, again, these are new formulations. So with the previous shades that I had, it's different to work with the new formulation so this is what i have created first with my previous shades i'm trying to get it formulated differently but with the same shade but if you're in the makeup industry you know that it's it's it, it's work but these two shades i've been wanting for the very longest time so we have we're gonna start out with honeymoon first so this one is Honeymoon, and this one is just a pop open. It has a little mirror. Look at Honeymoon. It is just the most perfect, warm... It's like a warm blush with a pink undertone. It's just... Oh, it's so pretty. And then the second one we have is Salmon Pink. This one, it looks a little bit intimidating, but it's very pretty on your cheeks or even on the eyes. But this is Salmon Pink. It is so pretty. And with both of my blushes, they are very pigmented, so you only need a tap and you're good to go. But today we're going to be using Honeymoon. Same thing as the bronzer. I'm going to let you guys see how it applies and how you really don't need that much. Because I know you're probably looking at this and you're like, girl, that's tiny. But a little goes a long way. Watch. Do you see that? Do you see that? I want to be very warm today. So that is why I chose Honeymoon. Look at that. But you see how I'm just tapping it in and I'm pretty much done. I'm telling you, I formulated these powders so they really just work with your skin. They just melt right into it. You don't need to fuss or move your brush around too much. See how fast that was? That was blush. And you can see it just looks so beautiful on the skin. Then. The last product we have for the face, I have some lip products, but the last product for the face is highlighter. I am so excited for these. I knew for my highlighters I wanted something shiny and it just stands out. And I did exactly that. So we have two shades. Um, we have golden and mirror. I should probably take it out of the packaging. Hold on. Oh, even the packaging. Look at the packaging. Ooh. So we have golden and mirror. Oh, you can see my reflection. You can even see my stand. Here it is, very shiny, so pretty, very high quality. So this one is golden. And 
And then this one is Mirror, which is a light gold, like a light icy gold. And then as you guys saw, Golden was a true gold. They apply very smoothly as well. All of my powders apply smoothly because that's the biggest thing. I don't like patchiness. I don't like anything that you can tell that it's like rough on your skin. It's just all very smooth and soft looking. Like look how soft that is. And I don't have a filter on my camera. This is my actual skin. My highlighters are blinding. You can obviously wear it down by just doing a couple taps and putting it on if you want like a subtle glow. But if you're like me and you love to just go all out with highlighter, then you're gonna love my highlighters. I'm gonna take golden because this is like my everyday shade and it just matches with the warm look that I'm kind of going for today. And I am gonna be taking my Fenty Beauty 120 highlight brush because I love this brush for highlight. It's the most, I think she calls it like her shark tooth brush. I love it. It just hugs your cheek so nicely. And I think it's called cheek hugging highlight brush. But anyways, we're just going to tap it in. And then we're gonna... Ooh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We're gonna put more. So I'm also showing you that you can build up the intensity. Y'all are gonna see me from miles away. Miles. And down the nose. Oh my gosh, I wish you could see it better on camera. Look at that, ooh. Look at that. Ooh, ooh girl. Mm. And then we're gonna do the inner corner. This is probably my my favorite, is the inner corner. Like, are you kidding me? Can you see that? There we go. Look at that. Mm. I'm trying to come up super close so you can see it. I love it. That is my bronzer, blush, and highlighters coming soon. Like from where I first started to now, I just can't believe that it came like this. But anyways, yeah, I'm just, we got some new lippies for y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and just take a Q-tip and just take off Whatever foundation and makeup probably got on my lips. He came out with three new lip products. I'm gonna start off with this one first. We have now a SPF lip balm. Comes in this little packaging. We take it out. Look at how pretty. I love the black and gold packaging. And she is SPF 15 and when you open her she looks like this. Well, oh, I've been getting questions about lip balms and also SPF lip balms. So here you go, an SPF 15 lip balm. Perfect for on the go when you're gonna be in the sun all day, if you're going to the beach. I definitely make sure I have this on me when I'm at the beach. With my lip balms, it is not greasy, it's not heavy on the lips either it's very comfortable but also very moisturizing so that is my new spf lip balm this is always in my purse a bag necessity we have my new lipsticks we have four shades to start out with first one is get nude this is how looks like and you just twist the bottom to bring it out so the idea behind these is they are a two-in-one so they are a lip liner and a lipstick in one this one is hbic this one's hbic 
They are very soft, very lightweight. They're not heavy on the lips. They also don't dry your lips out either. They don't drag. They apply very smoothly. This one we have is Berry Baby. Look at that. It's such a cute like pomegranate berry shade. And then the last one in the collection for now, we're just starting off with four. This one is Burnt Up. It's a really beautiful burnt red shade. Swatches and everything will be on my site when they launch and also on my Instagram when I do upload the pictures on there. My next beauties is my new lip mousse. They come in this packaging. I have three shades. So first one is Love Me. She's a really pretty color. Look at her. And open her. She looks like this. Very whipped, very moussey. So the idea behind these is to give you that matte lip, but it's not drying like a regular liquid matte lipstick. This is a velvet mousse finish and texture. So it is gonna just it's gonna dry matte but it's not a drying matte it's not gonna be uncomfortable it's very light on your lips doesn't dry them out this is this is the new matte y'all and then the next one we have is sweet thing sweet thing is this really pretty light neutral pink she's very sweet and this is her you can really just see the texture on the brush and very pigmented just one swipe and it's that color is there and the last one is sorry i keep looking over here because i have a business thing going on um last one is cheeky super cute and here's the brush i think we're gonna go in with the lip mousse because I've just never really seen anyone do this, so I definitely want you guys to see how it applies, how it works, how it looks. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna actually go into with the shade Love Me. I feel like it'll match this look really nicely. I'm gonna try and come a little bit closer so you can actually see my lips. One swipe. so good on the lips so this is the shade love me keep in mind if y'all don't know about color theory look it up this is how love me looks on me but obviously it will be a little bit different depending on your skin tone as you can see she applied very smoothly she's so soft and comfortable on the lips like i can move my lips around and it's not drying it's not uncomfortable it's very very comfortable and my lips are so soft mm. so that was pretty much just a quick video showing some new brazy beauty high products that will be launching again i already I'll, I'll put the date again right here of when they will be launching and i'm just so excited for you guys to get your hands on these also look at my shirt anyways thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope to see y'all in your new crazy beauty high products very soon <laughs>